point we are embarking ourselves in the path of meditation. Sometimes you get this courage because you don't know that there are certain things that you need to pass through in the process of stillness. Of course in the same sitting and at the same in, in the first city you are not going to be totally empty and so on. Mostly because you have a preconceived idea of what meditation is. So the best thing is to start with, okay, what really is meditation, which is just simply reposing in oneself effortlessly. It's not a technique. It's not The technique helps you to get into that sense of stillness, but meditation is not necessarily a technique or is not a technique. It's just a repose of oneself with no agenda, not wanting to go anywhere, simply resting in oneself. Now, the mind don't like that because the mind have the habit of being active. So is the body is not used to be still in one position. Or the emotions arise and bring forward all the things that perhaps you have not looked at it because you don't have time or you have not taken the time to put off your system. So meditation just simply is a resting moment where you are recharging. Naturally the life force recharge without your participation. So if you are finding it difficult to sit, don't get discouraged. Help yourself with some breath, with some pranayamas. There are many pranayamas that we, we teach in our courses. In the basic course we have that uh, in, induction to meditation where you have a practice every day and you start educating your mind to be more subtle and, and, and more still. Help yourself also with, with your diet, with your lifestyle, because sometimes the restlessness is in the body because you ate something inappropriate for your body constitution, or you ate too much or too little. So the body as well can bring pains and discomforts when you are sitting. So your, your lifestyle, your yearly purifications, that helps also to quiet the mind. Now, when you sit, be relaxed and be innocent and acknowledge that all the things that you have no pain attention, the impressions that you are not aware, let's say we're sitting in the garden and the wind is going and the birds and there are many other um, stimulations, but the mind, the ears, the senses are recording that. We may be not aware all the time of all those senses, or those stimulations. And when we sit in meditation, then those unfinished uh, impressions come forward in different ways. In the form of pain, in the form of images, in the form of um, thoughts. So don't pay attention to that. They are really irrelevant because it's just meditation is like a shower that is getting rid of all that weight, all that heaviness. So my suggestion to you is keep up. Simply every day sit for 20 minutes and wash your mind, wash your the, the impressions. It's the constancy that it will make you successful in your meditation. And, and from that then you regenerate and all the benefits that now the science world are really um, acknowledging how much meditation is the health of the future.